Hi guys, in this video I want to show you this mobile microphone kit from Sennheiser uh, and it basically includes the microphone, the cell phone holder and this uh, Manfrotto tripod uh, and there's actually two versions you can get of this. There's one with this microphone which is their newer MKE 400 uh, and there's also another microphone which I reviewed previously which is the MKE 200 also on camera directional microphone but really really compact so this one's a bit bigger because of that a bit more directional so if size maybe doesn't matter um, then get this version if you you know let's say you're going to be working exclusively with mobile devices and maybe you really want to have the smallest possible size you might want to get the other version uh, the, some of the cool features maybe about this mic first I'll talk about is that it comes with the windscreen uh, which is removable and uh, just like the, the other microphone uh, the design of this is really cool it's, as in it gives you a sort of a, a wind kind of a capsule that uh, encompasses the actual microphone inside it and it has a hidden internal shock mount and essentially that's going to help you isolate any of the handling noise uh, that otherwise with a microphone would pick up uh, the microphone itself like I said it's a little bit larger than the previous one uh, the MK200 but it's still fairly light so that's a nice thing uh, and you actually have gain control, you have three settings for it. Uh, you have a high pass filter, you can turn it on and off easily. Uh, you have your power button and a little light, LED light indicating that when it's powered on. Uh, and then another cool thing that they added here on the other side is you have a volume rocker and you have a headphone jack. So you can actually monitor the audio uh, coming in straight from the microphone before it ever goes into your recording device, your cell phone or your camera. Now, like I mentioned before, you also get the cell phone holder, which is solidly built. It's pure aluminum, uh, and it gives you like these basically you know, ways to loosen and attach the whole thing. So, for example, if you loosen this up, and for example, loosen this one, then you're able to remove the phone, and this basically works on a little spring mechanism. So it can accept pretty wide phones, and once you actually put your phone in there, it already holds it pretty well. But if you want the extra security, then you can tighten. The, the clamp there so this way there's no way that's going to move apart then you also have an option to rotate the phone so you can have it vertical option at an angle if you wanted to or you know horizontal or pretty much any way you want because you can keep on rotating it once you like the angle then you have this little switch here and you can use that to lock it when you get the whole kit you also get this Manfrotto uh, little tripod which is uh, going to allow you to put your whole setup on a flat surface. Now, let's say if your flat surface isn't perfectly level, uh, then the, there is actually a quick little here uh, level adjustment. So if you press the button, you can adjust, sort of make sure that you're getting the, the horizon nice and straight in your shots. Now, just because it's called a mobile kit doesn't mean that you can't use this shotgun microphone uh, with your camera, for example, like I'm using right now, uh, or with an uh, audio recorder or things like that. You can obviously do that. But it just simply means that they give you another TRRS cable that allows you to connect to smartphones. There is actually another cable you can get, like for example here, my iPhone, I can just use that cable, but I have an Android phone that does not have a headphone jack. And definitely if you're gonna have some of the newer iPhones, you're also not gonna have that. So you can get other cables that have the, basically the, the USB-C cable, uh, and there's also a version you can get for the iPhone, the lightning cable. So one of the neat features of the MKE 400 microphone, just like with their MKE 200, is that, like I said, you can use it uh, not just with your standard camera setup, but you can also uh, up the quality of your audio with your mobile devices. So definitely if you're, let's say, somebody who's doing a lot of live streaming on your phone, vlogging, things like that, uh, that's gonna help you just produce better quality videos, because as we all know, audio is I don't know, you could say 50 or 20 percent or 70 percent of the final video quality. Definitely, if you're not going to have good audio quality, but you have really beautiful images, your whole video is just going to suffer a lot. So just remember that whether it's the MKE 200 or the 400 microphone, uh, you can use it not just with your camera, but you can also use it with your smart devices. So if you're doing a lot of, let's say, live streaming or vlogging or that kind of stuff on your phone, and you want to up the audio quality on your mobile device, then that's definitely one way to do it. Now there is actually another cool product that uh, Sennheiser released, which is a uh, lav microphone. It's the XS lav mobile microphone, uh, designed specifically again for mobile devices. I'm really glad that Sennheiser included an extra long audio cable with this. It just simply means that it allows you to get away, let's say, further from your phone uh, and still be able to get clear audio. Uh, and, uh, and that's mainly because of this really good quality capsule uh, that this lav microphone comes with just as you know most of the other lav microphones from Sennheiser 
So right now let me just do a few quick tests with my phone so you guys can hear how the audio sounds with each of these microphones and without it. So now I'm on my Android phone, so I'm actually connected through the USB-C uh, cable that you can get. Uh, and this is on the MKE 400 microphone, uh, it's the new one that I got, so I'm testing it out so you guys can also uh, see how it sounds. So anyways, this is how it sounds when it's on the, on the phone. Now this is, I'm just basically recording it with the, the phone app that doesn't have really any manual uh, control over the audio, so it's out of gain. Uh, and in the microphone I just set it to the, the middle setting, so uh, hopefully it gets good quality audio. And I have also the high pass filter on. So anyways, this is how it sounds. This is again on the on an Android phone using the MKE 400 microphone. And right now, just uh, so you guys can hear as a comparison, uh, this is basically audio coming in straight off the built-in microphone on my phone. This is how it sounds. And uh, there is a little bit of wind, so I don't know if that, that will help because uh, with the microphone, obviously I have the windscreen on. And right now I'm using an old iPhone uh, just so I can test out this lavalier microphone. So this is what you guys are hearing right now. Uh, and again, it's a little bit windy. Uh, hopefully the microphone works well uh, in both windy and non-windy conditions. And uh, again, I'm not using any kind of sophisticated recording device. This is on an iPhone. So like I said, I don't have any manual control over the audio. But anyways, this is how it sounds. So anyways, that's it for this video. I uh, hope you guys found it useful. And now you know that if you're looking to increase the quality of the audio on your mobile devices, and also have a microphone that uh, you know that you can use with a camera and audio recorder then definitely take a look at this mobile kit from Sennheiser with the, either the MKE 200 or 400 microphone or get yourself this mobile lav microphone that they released. Uh, my name is Tom Antos and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!